read all the book post. Hi everybody, this is my Bout of Books 14 TBR and unboxing. For those of you who don't know, Bout of Books is a readathon which takes place at various times throughout the year and is hosted by Amanda at On a Bookbender and Kelly at Reading the Paranormal. I will link all the information in the description below. This year's readathon takes place from the 17th to the 23rd of August and I'm really excited about it because after the crazy stress of Booktubeathon last week, it's going to be nice to just have a really relaxing readathon. Talking of Booktubeathon, as with my TBR for that, my Bout of Books TBR is also full chock-a-block of authors who are going to be attending Wireshot in October. For those of you who don't know about Wireshot, it is a one-day convention festival taking place on the 28th of October this year in Uxbridge. I will link all the information in the description below. It's just going to be really awesome and great and I'm really excited about it. But anyway, let's just get on with the unboxing. I ordered these the other day. I ordered five books from the why I shot book list and I don't have a clue which one's which so let's just get started so here we go oh oh Amazon crap I hate the Amazon crap so the first book is Castle of Shadows by Ellen Renner this is about girl named Charlie she is a princess in a kingdom that I can't remember the name of right now but her mother the queen disappeared a long time ago no one knows what happened to her and after she disappeared the king went mad and now there is revolution afoot and all this crazy talk is happening and Charlie is powerless to stop it oh what's gonna happen oh oh I'm very excited to read this second unboxing oh I really hate it when the blooming Amazon thing does this so annoying. Two books, two books. So first up we have Banished by Liz Yeager. This is about a girl named Kit and she is a black heart which as far as I can work out from the synopsis which I've tried not to read too much of because spoilers. I think she and her family help banish evil and one day while her family are away she lives with her cousins and one day while they are out or one weekend or some how long are they out? They're away on missions for some reason. This prince, this fey prince turns up on their doorstep and she has to protect him. It's a love story. I went for a love story. I don't often read love stories but I went for one today because this sounded intriguing and yeah I just like it just it just sounds intriguing and I was in the mood for a bit of romance. I'm not often in the mood for a bit of romance but I was with this. Next up we have more Amazon crap because they like to ruin the rainforest. Next up, we have A Brighter Fear and Impossible Love by Kerry Drury. I'm really excited about this because it's about a young girl living in Baghdad during the Iraq War and it's basically about her growing up and it's a love story and it's a coming of age story and it just sounds really, I don't know, I don't feel like I read enough stories about stuff that happens in the real world in other countries and this is kind of my attempt at that because I just feel like it's something I should do as a reader and I don't read enough and I should but this sounds good and also it's got a really pretty cover then it it's really good it's quite short it's got quite big um, text so it shouldn't take me very long and yeah okay next next package Package, please don't do the stupid thing. Ah. Okay, two final books. This is Rockaholic by CJ Skews, and it is about a girl. She goes to a concert and then she faints, and she ends up backstage somehow or other, I think. And then somehow the rock star, she sort of somehow ends up kidnapping him. I think that's what it is. Look at the cover really funky um yeah this is gonna be cool it has curly whirlies on the back or it has the word curly whirlies on the back so it's gotta be good next up we have a book that's got a sticker on it ah. this is night school by cj Doherty. this is the first in the night school series and it's about the girl who ends up going to a place where i think they teach magic it's a night school unsurprisingly and i think it's where they teach magic good tbr like this TBR it's gonna be a good week let me know in the comments below if you're taking part in Battle of Books 14 because it's gonna be a really interesting read of one I'm really excited about it and I don't feel like a lot of people take part in Battle of Books and more people should because it's a really fun cool relaxed read of one so let me know if you are if you're not you should do the thing that is it for me today I'll see you again soon but until then bye